Francois and Bernard Bachet were in Paris in the early 1950s. After World War II, uh, they were out of the army, the war was over, Francois was interested in music and sculpture. And the process of inventing and solving problems with simple materials is just something that fascinated him from his 20s on. He bought lots of different kinds of stringed instruments and studied how they worked and what made something sound good. The Bechets were much more interested in a very communicative inclusive sort of music that sounded very entrancing and accessible. Francois told me, we cornered the market on spooky sounds until synthesizers came along. With the aluminum piano, they used a piano keyboard, the hammers, the key action of a piano. Also, these whiskers, these piano strings and metal rods that come up decoratively. And then these five of these fans that would amplify and project the sound. It's hard to identify what inspired them with these fan shapes. I mean, certainly as a sculptor, Francois was well aware of all, everything that was going on before the war and since the war in Paris, and certainly was aware of, uh, you know, you can look at those and think of Miro, you can look and, and think of Calder and Jean Arp, certainly. And it just shows a sensibility that was able to take in so much of the visual art world that they had come up in. Seeing this instrument this afternoon live is a fantastic, stunning experience. It really pulls you in. It's magnetic. Mm -hmm.